everyone, what is the probability of getting exactly two fives in four rows of a die? What is the probability of getting one three in seven rows of the die? So basically we have two problems here. So let's do the first one. Um, so basically what we're using is a binomial experiment and these rules. So for a five, the probability of getting a five is one sixth. So the probability of not getting a five is five sixths. So what you do for that one is the probability of two fives equals, and uh, we're going to do the fives is one sixth, and we want two, and we're rolling it four times, so the other two have to be um, five six. It has to be not a five to get exactly uh, two fives. So that's two. Now since we have the two twos here, we're going to use um, we have we're doing four, and you these two add up to four, and you take this second number and that goes there. Now this is when we're rolling it four times goes along with this. So if you see right here, this is 4 choose 2, and that equals 6. So this is 6, and then um, multiply this out. You're going to get 1 divided by 36 times 25 divided by 36. And this gives you, um, this, is, this right here is going to be uh, 1 6 times 25 divided by 36 and this all equals 25 divided by 216. You use a calculator you should get approximately 0 0.116. Now let's try the second one getting exactly 1 3. Now the probability of getting a 3 is 1 6 and the probability of not getting a 3 equals 5 6. So basically the 1 3 is 1 6 to the first power. Everything else, and there's a total of 7, so that's 7 choose, and this is going to be 6. All the other ones can't be a 3. So we're going to put the 6 here. It's always a good idea to get these two to match up. And if, um, do we even have this on here? We don't have it on here. But this equals 1. Um, so, no, this equals 7. So this is going to be 7 times 1 sixth um, times uh, 15,625 divided by 46,656. Now simplifying this, we're going to get 109,375 divided by 279,936. And if you use the calculator, because you could have put just put this in the calculator, you would have gotten approximately 0 0.391. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.